Hi everybody. Uh, today I'm gonna show you about function and event graph and other stuff. How we can use it in our Unreal Engine project. So go to the level blueprint. Here is our level blueprint. Uh, first of all, I just want to go to our project settings and from here uh, input. I show you before how we can add input. I just add a action input and I just name it uh, input event test. It doesn't matter what name you give so I press the keyboard button and press G and this is how you can add any uh, input also you can select your own input which I show you previously uh, so, so I just add input uh, uh, event test this is one way to add uh, uh, input also we can use custom event this is how we can add many function and many feature in our project so I name it a custom event test because I want to test it. Also I add our input event uh, test and also you can add any uh, keyboard key like I want to add H key. If I search it, you can see it. So both input and uh, H key have two feature press and release. And if you select the input, uh, you can so you can make it if you want you can make it a replicated or not replication is for multiplayer also you can add input i add input uh, name it boolean also you can change the input and uh, we can make uh, another uh, variable like float and also you can give value also and i just add a print screen in here and i add the uh, string is this is working and basically this function we can access this function from here we just create a custom event anywhere else and when we need to use it if we search we can add it like this and if we press it we will go to the custom event now if we play and press g our code is working also you sh uh, see the float uh, variable in here with which we can give uh, a value now I add a, a variable int variable int is a variable type I name it int and from here I can add a function called uh, switch on int and this function we use uh, I show you how you can use it so when we press uh, h1 it will show 1 h2 2 times it will show uh, uh, 2 and when we press 3 time it will show 3 so I set a input, I get a input and add plus one. Whenever we press H, it will add one value each time. So I add four, uh, four input, four pin, and I remove the default one. So I add a print string. Uh, this is the print string and I add one in here. I just copy it, control C, control V, and control C, control V. I add it three times. Uh, I add two here and I add three here. So when we press H one time, it will show print string one. When we press it seven time, it will show two. And when we press a third time, it will show three. So that's the thing. Every time one is uh, added in here. So I just play, press one, two, three, three time, and one, two, three, print string showing. So this is how we can use uh, our custom event, but we can use the same function in our functions. If we create a functions, I just press and create a function I name it uh, function check we can add the same thing in here I just copy it control C select everything first of all I just delete it I add uh, function check in here so control V first of all I copy everything and now compile and save and from event graph just drag and drop the function add with the press and we add the function in here the code in here if we play again and press h1 h2 h3 it will show one two three just like before so the question comes in our mind what is the difference between uh, event graph and function so we can add a delay node in event graph uh, custom event but we cannot add it in our function if we search it we will know uh, we don't find any delay in here 
so that's the pros and cons that's the disadvantage of using function but we can use it as a pure test so when we make it pure test we can use it like this you see previously we use a great player controller great player character basically that function create like that and make it pure and then we can use it another benefit is uh, we can add a return value in here which we cannot add in the uh, custom event so here is the return value in the return value we can return any node also like int uh, variable boolean and other stuff but uh, we cannot return in the custom event that's the benefit of using function and disadvantage of using custom event so i just uh, control z and delete uh, this there is other function we can use in our function uh, the other benefit is if we use in a custom event it will uh, uh, select messy like uh, spaghetti like uh, noodles but if we use a function there is all code in a separate function in here which we cannot show also there is option for local variable we can only use local variable in our uh, function and it uh, only we can use in our function we can use it as a get we, we can use it in a se as a set but we cannot use it in our custom event here is the custom event uh, if we go to the our event graph we don't see any local variable but when I insert the function we, we see that so this is the benefit of using a custom event so this is for today's tutorial bye bye everybody